Hello, and welcome. In today's video, we will talk about the new EB-5 Reform and Integrity Act of 2022. The EB-5 Immigration by Investment Program recently got an upgrade, which turned a good idea. The U.S. Congress passed the EB-5 Reform and Integrity Act of 2022. E. B-5 has been a popular program in India but new reforms make it more responsive to immigrants and safe for investors. 90% of EB-5 visa applications are handled by regional centers, and the new law includes tough and greater industry-wide transparency mandates for everyone associated with and representing the regional centers. Ranging from fund managers to foreign immigration consultants, investors in EB-5 projects can feel more secure about their investment owing to the fact that the new law brings greater openness and transparency. One of the most important changes in the new law is to allow concurrent visa filing. The concurrent filing allows Indians residing in the U.S. with legal visas to adjust their status. The U.S. there's no longer the requirement of returning to their home country to do it. It allows them to stay, study, work and live in the U.S. till their permanent green card is processed. The concurrent filing allows investors in the United States, on certain non-immigrant visas to apply for adjustment of U.S. resident status. Form. I-485. While filing their petitions to participate in the EB-5 program, and, I-526 East, at the same time. The new law also adds predictability to EB-5, because it extends the regional center program to 2027. This allows people to invest in confidence in EB-5 projects, as a means of obtaining their green cards from the USCIS. A legal dispute related to the new law resulted, in a recent settlement agreement between regional centers and the USCIS. As part of this agreement, the USCIS will be making it easier, and quicker for investors to file initial petitions to participate in an EB-5 project. The Act has increased the minimum investment required to qualify for an EB-5 green card. The Act increased the capital investment minimum from $500,000 to $800,000 for projects. In the targeted employment areas. A targeted employment area is designated on the basis of high unemployment in a geographic area. High unemployment regions have historically been more common, in the EB-5 program than in the other two classes. For investment projects outside of the targeted employment areas, the minimum investment amount will be $1.5 million. They can make a direct investment in a business or invest through a regional center. These minimum investment levels apply to all visa applicants in the EB-5 Immigrant Investor Program. The EB-5 Reform and Integrity Act of 2022 has dramatically increased the confidence with which foreign nationals can make EB-5 investments. The Act will make the EB-5 industry more accountable and transparent, while also easing and improving the immigration experience. For the investors and their eligible family members through the EB-5 visa. Thanks for watching.